A new season began in StarCraft 2, like two months ago. <laughs> Today, we're going back on the ladder. I haven't played any ladder games in probably, probably like two, maybe three months. That's probably the longest I've ever taken a break from playing 1v1 in StarCraft 2. First order of business though, we need to pick a, a new username. Every season you can choose a new username in game. I am open to recommendations. Donnie Vermillion, I'm your worker. Town Center Rush, Throco, Bydis Nidis, Lowoko, Budget Serral for now is winning. Cat Food Genius, Did Loco Quit SC2, The Traveling Circus, Pro Tosser, Toot Toot, Dutch Cheese, Late Game China. Wait, <laughs> that's a different game. Wannabe Serral, Brenda OnlyFans. I don't know about Ben Dover. I'm really not sure. Mike Litterus. Honestly, picking a nickname is one of the hardest things in, in you know, every season of StarCraft 2. Biggest dickus. We could just do a Twitch chat emote. That definitely works. Like, we could definitely just go Keck W. That, you know. But it's kind of cringe. Omicron. Omicron is kind of a fun word. But I don't know, guys. I, mm, I don't know. I feel like it's a bit too edgy. Lenny the Red Nose Zirkling. Step Serral. <laughs> Step Serral. <laughs> no, guys. Then I got stuck in Master 1. I don't want that. Dronely Fans. Dronely Fans was one of my previous nicknames. That one... Yeah, Dronely Fans is definitely a top tier. But that was mostly like a year ago when OnlyFans became like, you know, more popular. Loco, are you procrastinating playing a game as all StarCraft 2 players do? Yes. Twitch Prime. That's, that's a great... That's a great nickname. I agree, chat. For lack of a better choice, I feel like Twitch Prime could definitely, uh... Smash like. Winter's Wife. Harstam Senior. Pull my finger. <laughs> pull my finger. Butter my biscuit. Doesn't even work, man. None of these names can... Ugh. None of them fit. Zirkling Lester. Even that doesn't work. We can just do It's a Zirkling Lester. Smaller tap a Zerk. Looks like you mashed some poor feather's dog, Sarge. It's a Zerglin, Lester. Smaller type of Zerg. Underscore? <laughs> underscore? Alright, fine. Are we really gotta do... Underscore? <laughs> Just because Brian says it in a funny way, the text-to-speech bot? Underscore? <laughs> Alright. Will be known as underscore. Oh, also, by the way, I got a new keyboard like a week ago. And I've never played StarCraft with this keyboard before. And the F1 through F4 keys that I use for camera location hotkeys are in a different place. Loco, do a warm-up game? No, 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 no. We don't need warm-up games, dude. We're up against a Terran player. So at least we can't be proxy void rate, cannon rushed, proxy gateway. You know, at least none of that is happening. So, you know, that's that's a start. I did it! Nice. Is this the same person we just played against? Who just instantly left the game? All right, a Barco Terran player on Pride of Altaris. Please play me. Yes! Guys, he didn't leave. Woo! All right, all right, all right. Now, where is he going to plant those proxy barracks? That's what I want to know, baby. Wait, no, he probably isn't cheesing. This map, though... Um, in case you're wondering what it is, it's called Pride of Altaris, and I've seen like two tournament games on it in general. Donation confirmed. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, this something. is why we can't have nice things. Nah, it's okay, it's okay. My opponent in the previous two games was just not having the grandest of times, I guess. The reason why people do that, by the way, in the higher leagues, is to purposefully be in the lower leagues, so they can beat up people while actually being good at the game. 
So they, they will basically purposefully lose games and bring their MMR all the way down to like Platinum League or Gold League or whatever, and then basically go like 50 and 0. Because they're much better than, you know, you would imagine. Good old smurfing, huh? Isn't that fun? Anyway, um, I have casted maybe three games on this map. Not really a whole lot. But I'll try and play a normal game and we'll go from there. So you can hide an overlord up there, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so there's the scouting SCV going into the main base. He doesn't really need to go into the main base, but... Maybe he's just feeling ambitious. Okay. My first metabolic boost, guys. There's a command center on the low ground and everything, too. I think I should probably park my overlord over there, to be honest, and not, like, all the way out there. I'm gonna try and park the second one in that area. <laughs> Whoa, that was slow reaction time on me, dude. I didn't even see the Reaper until it was already gunning up my things. That's okay, chat. I saw Dark doing the same thing recently. The only thing Dark didn't do, though, is forget his second queen early on. Ah, potato, potato. What's the difference? Okay. There's the third base. Okay. Inject one, inject two. Yeah, so this keyboard is going to take a little bit of getting used to, but I don't think it's going to be the end of the world. There should be Hellions on the minimap soon enough. Okay. Okay, there you go. Adding the drones back to the gas. Running a couple of new drones over here. Eh, not the cleanest production here, but should be okay. I didn't make an OV, right? Should have. Yeah, I did. They're just a little late. It's okay, chat. Where's her? A scan in the main base? Really? Scan at this point in a game is actually very expensive. We'll go add an add on a couple of spore crawlers. We require more minerals. We must place that on creep. Okay. We require more minerals. Just need to make sure I chase down these units on the minimap. Okay. Yeah, my uh, my keyboard definitely takes a little bit of getting used to. So I, I used to run a tankless layout, and now this is like, I think they call this uh, an 80% layout. I'm not exactly sure. But basically the F keys are in a slightly different spot. I used to camera location hotkeys for the F keys. And uh, the position of those is ever so slightly differently. It's technically closer by, so I can imagine it should, should be better, but... At least in theory, I feel like it should be nicer. God, I thought there was a weird Protoss unit right there running up the ramp. <laughs> you see that thing? Okay, so I still haven't seen much. I'll double up on the spore crawlers.
Ah, I could just have made a uh, third base over there. The scouting on this map is different. Okay. Going in for a Zirkling run by. Okay, we'll do another big run by. Because I think my queens alone can probably hold his pushes, because I've got 12 of those. Not bad. Okay. Little bit sloppy. Oh, that's fine. For some reason, my uh, hotkeys right there were Mimi. Going to a hive. Yeah, I feel like I'm fat fingering my hotkeys pretty bad. Okay. Oh, he still has a decent amount of units though. Going into the burrow upgrade right now. Cheeky little bangling run by. Doing another one. Do you not have creep in the center of these these plateau things? I guess not. Okay. 
Oh, I never started up that upgrade. It's not good. Let's burrow some cheeky little Zerklings down. Probably a good idea. Because my opponent can't have too much more. We need an idle army button, man, like you can have in uh, an AoE 4. Oh, did he try to go for the low ground one over here? Oh, that's obviously where the gold is. <sighs> Don't even uh, didn't even consider that. Got him. All right, Zerk OP confirmed. Thank you guys. I'll take that as a compliment. This is the keyboard I used to use, which is still really nice. I just wanted to try something new. Anyways, so this is where the F1 through F4 keys are, right? So they're like, you know, this is the one key right over here, and that's the F1 key right over there. On the, on the new keyboard I'm using right now, the F1 key is right above the one key. You see what I mean? So they're like slightly in a different place. Anyways, it's, um, it's a little bit of getting used to. I keep checking, or I keep tapping the wrong key. The crazy thing is, and this has confused many people in Twitch chat, is that it doesn't have a wire. It's, it's a wireless keyboard. Is that weird? I'm not a real gamer. I know. Fake gamer confirmed. It's like a controller now. No numpad either. No. Loco, it's not confusion. It's disappointment. About half a year ago, everyone in Twitch chat was making fun of me when I bought a wireless mouse. I bought a wireless mouse and everyone in Twitch chat's like, oh my god, fake game or confirmed. Guess what happened? I went to Stay at Home Story Cup like two months ago. And literally all the programmers there, including Raynor, including Lambo, Elazer, Kalazur, all of them, they all use wireless mice these days, guys. Our second victim. I mean opponent. We have ourselves a Protoss opponent. That'll be no problem for underscore. Gonna open up with my favorite macro build. Is this Berlingrad? It is. My favorite macro build, the 12 pool. Donation accepted. Hey, what's going on, Killman? I didn't know that your finances were in a state where you can't afford a numpad. Here, take this. I hope it helps. Thank you very much, man. It's true. I don't have a numpad. I never use a numpad, guys. I'm not an Excel spreadsheet connoisseur. I enter numbers using the numbers at the top of the screen like a plip. Oh, I was opening up with a 12 pool and I accidentally made drones, guys. Do you think my opponent is scared anyways? Let's see. Let's see. So I've gone for a 12 pool. <clears throat> but do you think he realizes that I've messed up? <laughs> or do you think he's already hardcore in the defense at home? We need a new subscriber goal to allow Loco to afford a numpad. 
Agreed. I wonder if my opponent already is freaking out though, because he scouted earlier with a probe that it was a 12 pool. So if I get to the other side of the map and there's two gateways and everything, it's gonna be funny because I, I've just, you know, I've not even got a gas. I've only made two sets of links. Ah, he didn't freak out, guys. Mission failed. We'll get him next time. <clears throat> Anyways, we'll get a couple of Zerg links into the main base. Oh, 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 where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh. Nope. Too fast, bro. Where did Brenda go? Brenda, go inject the base. What the hell? Okay, so we have vision of both of his uh, things. Pylons. So, so far he hasn't gone for any tech structure. It's a bit strange. Okay guys, it's not gonna be any tech. There's no tech here from this Protoss player at all. That's what it is. All right, gotcha. Fair enough. What? No! Bullshit. Okay. Oh, never mind. Guys, it's not bullshit. It's fine. Yeah, apparently uh, on this map, I thought the dogs were invulnerable, but apparently if you click them often enough... Okay, well now that's just bad luck. Did I still not start up link speed? Oh, my macro is so killer, chat, that I didn't even need the link speed yet. I see how it is. <laughs> That's definitely the reason, right? Uh, I started it up, but it didn't start because I didn't have minerals for it. Turns out upgrades don't just cost gas. It's crazy. Uh, I guess I'll go for a quick Evo chamber and a Roach Warren too. We can pretend that all of this gas bank that I have right now is intentional that way. An observer? What? Chet, where's the Stargate? Huh? Oh, he's sieged up right over here. Prepare your Keck W's. <laughs> Got him. Alright, um... So this guy, um... Opened up with... A robo facility. Now that's a crazy day. The only problem is that my macro is trash here. And I'm still losing a little bit more than I probably should be, but. Honestly, he's supposed to be sniping creep tumors right now, but since he lost the observer. He doesn't have a third base yet either, so I guess I'll just keep making units. We require more Vespin gas. Okay. If he doesn't have a third base, he's gonna go for an attack. This is higher level math, chat. I'll explain it to you later, okay? Just kidding, it's very easy. Um, okay, no, we'll go for Roach Speed over here. I'll get a gas geyser going there too. That's such a late third base, isn't it? Such a late third base. 
And it's his. The most latest third of his life. Okay, right now. Can't play music anymore on stream, so now you're stuck with me singing. Such a late third base. Should be banned. Oh, he's got the speedy boy upgrade. We require more minerals. Ah, fat fingering. Okay, we're gonna go. Dodge the balls! Dodge the balls! Okay. Loco screws up in three. Two. There's two balls now, Chad. I'm scared. He hasn't got charged though, so I feel like I should definitely continue onwards, but since my multitasking is not very good. Oh, I really need hive. You know what's crazy about this game compared to like Age of Empires 4? This is one big difference I'm noticing, okay? So like in this game, when I click on things and then I click on other things, they actually go and do the thing that I want them to do. New subscriber detected. This is wild. Like oftentimes I click on a villager and I'm like, go build this thing. And they're like, ooh, there's a tree. I'm gonna go cut down the tree instead. And it's it's mind-bogglingly frustrating how bad... Oh god, no! Ooh. That was about a split second away from being a disaster chat, even though there were no balls there. <laughs> Killed his own zealots, bro. Okay, let's go again. Oh, no. Did I win there? I don't think I won. Let's go back. Should probably hotkey my fourth base as well. Just a thought. Greater Spire coming up. Oh. Oh, I should have committed, eh?
Zerk. Imba. Confirmed. All right, guys. We're up against Ermin Trout. This is my third proper game. Back on the ladder. <sighs> We're up against the Grandmaster player. I don't think I'm going to be able to beat a Grandmaster. But you know what, chat? Now that I'm saying that, maybe I can try and go for like a cheeky little Roach Bush or something like that. That does mean we have to play a clean early game. But that shouldn't be all too... Oh, God. <laughs> that shouldn't be all too hard. <clears throat> Nobody saw that. Oh, no, 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 no. This is European Grandmaster. European Grandmaster. Wow, chat. You're being very toxic right now. Are you saying that Grandmaster on the NA server is not as hard? These days, you only need to be 5.1k MMR to be Grandmaster on EU as well, man. It's actually not like... You know, it's actually very doable. We require more minerals. We require more minerals. We At the beginning of the season, I saw a couple people post on Reddit that hit like, I think it was 4.8k MMR to get into Grandmaster League. At the beginning of every season when Grandmaster League first opens up after like two weeks, or after a week or so, there's always people very excited on Reddit about their Grandmaster League promotion. And pretty much all of those people get kicked out again within the week. Because uh, MMR goes up as the season progresses. Stay in. Boom got in with 4.7k. Dang. Anyways. So I'm thinking about going for a roach based push. Donation confirmed. Yo! Merry Christmas, you filthy animal. Wow, dude. Literally toxic. Hey, thank you very much. NMR. You too, dude. Hope you have a good time. Okay. Going for a quick third base. Just in case I can't go for a roach push. But also to make my opponent think, obviously, that everything is a-okay. Lose a zirkling there because I'm bad. New subscriber detected. Then go for a uh, creep tumor first here, which is something that he probably picked up on. So usually, if you want to go for like an aggressive push, you do want to make sure you go for a roach warren by about 3:30. Ideally, you kill the reaper. There is a little jump up pad over here inside of the main base. 330 should also be 36 workers. So at least 36 drones is what I'm looking for. Okay. Okay, now we save. I hit the Roach Warren inside of the main. If this is a Benshi opener, by the way, I could be in some trouble, but I think for now we're okay. Okay, 10 roaches. Well, this game already feels way better than the other one, guys. So you can make this an all-in by flooding with Zerklings right now as a follow-up. And I'm thinking about doing that. The only problem is that if it's a Benshi opener, I could be in some trouble. I haven't seen any... Uh, 
Hellions yet roaming the map either, which is also a bit of an issue. <sighs> okay, there's a Viking. Hey, nice. Whew. All right, that was a way cleaner game than the last two we played. So this guy is the rank 171. All right. 